The chapter warns Babylon, the virgin daughter, to sit in the dust and not be called tender or delicate. She is instructed to take millstones, grind flour, remove her veil, and wade through streams to expose her nakedness and shame. The Lord Almighty, the Holy One of Israel, is the Holy One of Israel. Babylon was angry with her people and desecrated her inheritance, but she showed no mercy. She claimed to be eternal, but her wickedness and wickedness led her to believe she would never be a widow or suffer the loss of children. However, disaster would come upon her and she would not know how to conjure it away. She is advised to continue with her magic spells and sorceries, hoping to succeed or cause terror. The counsel she has received has worn her out, and she is advised to let her astrologers come forward to save her from the coming disaster. They are like stubble, and they cannot save themselves from the power of the flame. <laughs>